Well, when it comes to the future of medicine, many are focused on the secrets still hidden deep inside us. And one of the places with the most potential is our gut. And new research finds it may have far more impact on our heart health than most people even realize. Our Dr. Frank McGeorge is here with a new study that helps explain why that is, Doc. Well, exactly, Pam and Karen. So, you know, our gut, our gastrointestinal system, is full of bacteria that play a huge role in our health and our risk for developing diseases. New research has actually identified a key connection to the risk of heart failure and also potential ways to lower that risk. We had previously shown that the gut microbiome produces a compound, we call it PAG, P-A-G, um, that contributes to heart failure but we didn't know what the microbial sources for it were. Dr. Stanley Hazen led the research at the Cleveland Clinic. He says they've since discovered that PAG is created when microbes in our gut break down the protein we eat. It just keeps showing up that the compounds that we're finding are derived from proteins which are more abundant in animal source foods. The study is published in the American Heart Association journal, Circulation Heart Failure. Our long-term goal always has been, how can we leverage this result to help patient care? One is uh, the development of new diagnostic tests, because by measuring PAG levels, we see that we can predict who's at risk for the development of heart failure, independent of risk factors. But Hazen says the information could also potentially be used to develop drugs to block those harmful compounds from forming and act as a new treatment for heart disease. For now, the research highlights the importance of a healthy diet for preventing heart disease. The concept of having more vegetables in one's diet and, and eating less red meat and less uh, meat or animal source products uh, seems to be a recurring theme. Even though we aren't searching for that in our research, it keeps popping up when we're really looking for what are the, the compounds in blood that track with the future development of disease. It's research giving new meaning to the idea that you are what you eat. Our biggest environmental exposure is what we eat. And it has a huge impact on our health. I'm always surprised by how important the gut microbiome is in our health. Now one of the next steps of the research is to identify the exact bacteria and their enzymes that help produce PAG and ultimately develop drugs to reduce PAG. And that's really interesting. So how much potential is there in studying the gut when it comes to other diseases? It's actually an enormous area of research. In fact, we've only scratched the surface so far, and we think really of a gastrointestinal system as just breaking down the food we eat. But in reality, it actually contains more than 70% of our immune system, and it plays a really significant role in so many aspects of our health. And that is no doubt going to be one of the future targets of more personalized medicine in the future, because it controls way more than you think. Yeah. You know, when my mom was sick, we were dealing a lot with gut, and we didn't realize how much things were connected. So yep. it made a big difference Absolutely. in educating ourselves. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you, Doc.